Hey vinyl community, how you doing out there? And welcome to Beetle Brad's channel. Today I'm doing something just a little bit different. Doing a video outside because it's hot outside, but it's pretty cool vinyl. So I got my shades on and we're about to rock this video. Believe it or not, Beetle Brad does collect other vinyl outside of Beatles and Elvis and other memorabilia and other things, you know, vinyl. So I want to show you what I've got in my Who and Rolling Stones. I just recently got these, so these are some of the ones that I've recently gotten, and I want to show you some of them. This is the Who, a quick one, and sell out. <laughs> Said it slowly, sell out. <laughs> this is when they started doing these albums. They did them as two albums. So I, I kind of like these. I know they're not the original, so yeah, it's kind of fun though because um, I do like the fact that you get two of them on one album. There you go, so that's one of the records. And I've played them, they sound terrific. They really are just so nice. And here's the second record. Here comes Mr. Buddy. He's he's coming to say hello from the outside. He's he's been out in the sun as well. This next one by the Who. Kind of a greatest hits. As this is excellent. This is really really cool. Um, and I really like the inside of this. Love this picture over here. This is this is fantastic of of the Who. An excellent, excellent picture of them. I don't think it had any fold-outs. <laughs> I'm kind of looking as I go. There's your, your song listing right here. And this is really great sound. Really, really recommend this one. This is really nice. I hope everybody's doing well out there. Hope you guys are holding up. All the virus stuff and all of that that's going on. Boy. So that's one of the records. Yeah, I hope everybody's staying safe and doing great. And there's the next record. There we go. Like I said, this is great. And I even have the original hype sticker. <laughs> yeah. Okay. This is a 180 gram new mix of the album that I just showed you. I showed you, like John used to say. A quick one. This this is, golly, I really never realized what a terrific album this was. Um, so this is on 180 gram. Yeah, it's heavy, man. <laughs> and this album, you know, I've got it on the on the other one there, like I just showed you. But this is really fantastic. The sound quality of this is just unbelievable of, of having it like this on the 180 gram. But it's it's really, really nice. Um, the next Who one is this one. Still in the original shrink. And still have the hype sticker for the Who album. This is for the movie Quadra... Uh, not Quadrophania. <laughs> <laughs> the kids are all right. Yeah, I've kind of got my mind on something else here. Um, yeah, I'll show you that again if you want to get the listings. That sorry, I'm going a little fast. I'm probably going too fast. Just, just got a lot to show you, and just kind of want to get it all in. So probably need to slow down just a bit. There's the record, and this is a really cool record set um okay there's the record again start pulling out on its own there's the next one and they kind of need how they, they they made these to look like uh movie or files or you know um tins <laughs> can't think what i'm trying to say um but yeah that's kind of really neat um and then it's got a really nice 
very cool booklet with it. Love that picture there. Boy, I tell you with Pete. Nothing like a drummer. I tell you, Keith Moon was the drummer. Ringo Starr was great. Charlie Watts was great. But nobody could touch Keith Moon. Keith Moon could really do it. He could really, really play. I I miss Keith Moon's drumming. Uh, it's a shame we no longer have Keith around. But yeah, he was he was just a phenomenal drummer. Just a phenomenal good drummer. Yeah. Nice booklet. You know, it's got got some great great pictures in there. Good stuff. Pretty, pretty much the whole booklet, too. All right, and then we're moving on to the Rolling Stones, and this is 20 times 5. Um, 20. I, I see, you know, I'm thinking of the Beatles' bootlegs. See, I get my mind off of this. It's, you know, 12 times 5. Okay, yeah, so you caught me. <laughs> I'm so used to the 20 times 5 by the Beatles. It's a bootleg that they took it off of this one, which is the Rolling Stones. Um, and I really like this. I, I really I really think this is great. And this is on the London label. It's an original uh, first pressing. Here's the inner sleeve. Well, let's see. Golly, Brad. Doing all kinds of stuff wrong. That's upside down. Did you guys catch that? <laughs> I'm sure you did. London. And this sounds great. This is this is just a unbelievable album. Man, is this album good. Excellent, excellent. And then an original Rolling Stones one. And no, I'm not going to pull the zipper down, John. <laughs> one of my viewers. The Rolling Stones. But yeah, it's got the original zipper, which, you know, if you're looking for this album and you want to you want to find the original, yeah, try to try to find it with the zipper. It's it's getting harder and harder to find. For years, I saw it in my record store, and I always kept saying to myself, yeah, I don't think I'll get it. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, now that I'm kind of collecting stones when I get stone stuff, it's a nice one to have. There's the label. I'm just all thumbs today. <laughs> there we go. Got it again. There again. Yeah, almost dropped it. Like I said, I'm, 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 I'm almost, I'm, I'm, I'm all thumbs. <laughs> then this is kind of cool. This is really neat how the Rolling Stones, they did this like a hexagon um, cover. And that's just, that's just neat, isn't it? I mean, you know, look at that crash. And then it opens up. Rolling Stones. Yeah, that's an excellent one, too. They just recently did that. Oh, well, not recently. A couple years, day, a couple years back for Record Store Day. Um, and I haven't gotten that. I don't know why. Just, I don't know. I'd like to, but it's one of those. It's like, well, I mean, my record store still has like six copies of them. <laughs> I can just go pick it up anytime I feel like it. Because it's there. Yeah, I just, I don't know, I just haven't gotten it. But it's still kind of fun, still kind of a neat album. Um, like I said, I like the hexagon shape of all of that. It's pretty, pretty cool. Uh, maybe I'll pick it up, I don't know. I've got plenty of other stones and other albums to show you. Just kind of doing something fun and different by showing you some other albums outside of Beatles. But yeah. Stay tuned for a whole lot more videos and a whole lot more cool vinyl to see on Beetle Brad's channel. So stay tuned, and as I say on my channel, I'm out of here. Take care, everybody.